Pennsylvania is Traverse the Abyss. For fans of Lamb of God, The Devil Wears Prada, and Chelsea Grin. All social medias, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Discord. You can find our music just about everywhere on Spotify, YouTube, Apple Music, and more. Stop by TraverseTheAbyss.com for our merch. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another local band, Smokeout. I am your host, is Tyler the Most BG. Back with our second song of the day from Fleeting Life, their metalcore band out of Michigan. This one's called Skull. On Instagram, you can go to at Fleeting Life Band Official. Please do that. Hit the follow button. Support them any way you can. That'd be awesome. They're actually going to be on the show in January. She'll so be able to hang out and talk with them for a little bit. I believe January 18th is the date. Let me confirm. I should have had this information ahead of time. I'm sorry. It is January 18th, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Please join us. For now, though, fleeting life with Skull, and I have a feeling this one's going to be crazy. Here we go. Spark it up. You got it. Wow. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Let's start this one again. I just like how it started. Let's go. I love those agony screams. Agony screams. Jesus. Brutal. That was brutal. Absolutely brutal. It's weird though, like when the singing parts come in, they just don't match to me. The the screams. They sound it sounds like a, a take and a stack, but it doesn't have like all the harmonizing and stuff I would expect it to. And then the screams come in and they sound so much more polished and just in your face and nasty. There's like a kind of like dissonant like dee, 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 going on, on the guitar right there. I do like that too. Uh man, the screams like they just hit you right in the face too. They're they're done really, really, really well.
I mean, it's not a blah, but it's it's damn near a blah. That blah, that part. That part was cool. Fleeting Life with Skull coming out of Michigan on Instagram at Fleeting Life Band Official. Please go follow and support them. I'm going to go 9.2 and I have some pros and cons. 9.2. I do prefer this one over Synthetic Love that we heard earlier today. But there's just something, there's something going on in the recording mixing aspect of the clean vocals. The clean vocals to me, I'm going to say this the nicest way possible. I, I, I almost don't think they're needed at all. And it takes away from how good the rest of the song is. It's something about how it's recorded and mixed. It doesn't match the rest of the song. It has like a phase cancellation or something going on. It doesn't have any, any like example. If you go back and listen to, I know this is a random, random example, but if you listen to Cove, Sayosin's album that Cove is on, the one that had all the hits on it, each time Cove sings, there's like there's his voice, a doubling, like a like a half octave up higher one, a half octave up lower or half octave down lower one, and it's mixed in like a unison sound, but you can hear all the the stacking and layering of it. I would attempt to do that if you guys are going to do more cleans um in the future just to like polish it up a little bit cuz to me it doesn't when you hear the clean part and then you hear the screen part come in, the screen part sounds it's just right in your face, super nasty. It sounds crispier, cleaner. That's the only con I got. Other than that, this song's awesome. And I think I'm gonna end up playing this one again later today on, on the stream, just because it, it it smacks you so quickly right out of the gate. And uh, the the clean parts, they, they bother me a little bit. It's not enough, it's not enough to like turn me off the song or anything like that. I'm not trying to be a hater, but that's just my, that's my advice for moving forward. But in general, between the three songs, Freddy Krueger would be my favorite. Skull will be my second favorite. Synthetic Love would probably be my third favorite. Although I do really, really like the synths going on in that one. Um, but all, all three have things within them that I really, really did uh, appreciate. Uh, and that's just my honest opinion. If you, if you don't like it, that's totally fine. You don't have to do anything with that advice whatsoever. I'm just trying to help. But uh, at the same time, you guys can help by going to Instagram and searching Fleeting Life Band Official. Please go hit the follow button. That'd be a lot cooler if you did. It'd be a lot cooler if you did. Right, Matthew, tell him. <laughs> but uh, yeah, otherwise, uh, please consider clicking the subscribe button for, for uh, this channel if you guys enjoyed uh, this reaction video. And please join me live on Twitch five times a week, three plus hours a day. 3.50 to 7.20 p.m. Pacific time. We always have guests, prizes, trivia, punishments, tortures, all kinds of stuff. Uh, and we haven't given anything away all week. So we're going to have a ton of stuff on the GoFundMe wheel today. Just so hopefully someone can win some merch and we can give it to them. That'd be awesome. Uh, other than that, though, I am your host who's had the most BG saying cheers. Keep blazing. And peace. I'll catch you next time. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Gypsy Lee. I'm Matt Gerber, and we are Scarlet and Harmony. For fans of bands like I Order's Murder, Infinite Annihilator, Lauren Ashore, Fit for an Autopsy, please feel free to check us out at Scarlet and Harmony on YouTube, Spotify, and anywhere else you may stream music. We'd really appreciate it. Hope you enjoy.